as promised, I created a video tutorial on how to backtest trade strategies using the TD Ameritrade Thinkorswim desktop app, which includes a free feature called On Demand. Hey, this is Rochelle and welcome to Multiple Passive Streams of Income. So first you're gonna need a TD Ameritrade account. Once you have that, you can download the Thinkorswim trade platform and I'll add a link to the description below so you can find all of the download links needed for all the different computer configurations. Once you click on that link, just scroll down and you'll find the various links. There are links for Windows users, Mac users, Linux users, and all other users. Now, once you have your Thinkorswim desktop app downloaded, click on the desktop icon to open it. Enter your TD Ameritrade account number and the password to log in. To backtest and simulate trades, we're gonna click on the On Demand button in the upper right hand corner of the Thinkorswim Live trading screen. This message may pop up, but let's just take a minute to read this because it explains what this virtual simulated backtester offers. Now, first of all, it's available 24 seven. It allows you to select any date and time to simulate. It allows you to fast forward and pause the data. It allows you to reset your virtual account to 100,000. We'll talk about why that can be useful later on. You can just play your trade tick by tick to simulate all the data changes that occur with each tick. You can simulate stock, options, futures, and Forex. You can monitor the profit loss of your simulated trades tick by tick, and you can easily go to your live trading screen by clicking the on demand button again. So we've clicked the on demand button to activate on demand, and you can tell we are in the back tester because the account shows we are in the virtual account mode. We can select the asset by typing the asset ticker into the field showed on the screen. Now we are using SPX, which is the S and P 500 index in this example. The back tester is set for March 9, 2022 at 7.01 PM and seven seconds. At this time, the SPX price was 4277.88. And we can click the double arrow icons to forward or reverse time in 10 minute increments if we like. We can also use the pause and play buttons to pause the action or allow the data to play and move forward. Now let's look at an example simulation. So I have the March 8th, SPX on the screen at 12:30 p.m. the price was 4243.44. I can expand any of the option chains available by clicking on their down arrows. I click the March 9th option chain to expand it and then I scroll down to get to the at the money prices which are visually shown where the call prices with the blue background lead into the call prices with the black background and vice versa for the put prices. This screen is paused currently as shown by the arrow in the upper right hand corner. To simulate a trade, you just right click on the option price you're interested in. I right clicked on an option price on the put side of the option chain. That allowed me to select buy and then butterfly. When you right click, you have the option to select buy or sell and to select all the various option strategies like iron condors, calendar spreads, covered calls, strangles, straddles, etc. And you can also create different custom setups. It gives you that option as well. But this particular example, I'm showing you that I'm buying a put butterfly. The order entry section is then gonna open and you can adjust the number of contracts, the strike prices, 
and other conditions of the trade. To see additional data, just click confirm and send and that opens an order confirmation screen. This will give you more details about the trade. So break even prices, max profit and loss, the cost of the trade, the buying power, which is the amount you're gonna need to make the trade, and then also resulting buying power information. If everything looks good about the trade, click send to simulate the trade. Now on the screen is a simulated trade in action and notice the POS flags next to the strike prices. Also notice the position section is open now and it shows the information about the trade and each leg of the trade since this is a multi-leg option trade. I advanced this simulated put butterfly trade by 10 minutes by clicking the two arrow icon next to the date and time field and the screen now shows the data at that date and time and it also shows the profit and loss data of the trade in the position section of the screen when you change date and times be mindful of pre-buffering that occurs as the software updates the data Wait for the pre-buffering to finish. It may take a few seconds, and then you'll be able to see the accurate data that results. If you want to preset your account to 100,000, click the reset button in the upper right-hand corner. This is helpful when you wanna clearly see the results of each simulated trade. The Thinkorswim platform also has a scan feature, and this can help to identify assets that may be tradable for certain strategies. I haven't yet used this feature, but as I increase my trading acumen, I plan to add this to my trading research and planning. Lastly, if you are in the back test mode, you can easily move to live trading by clicking the on demand button. So definitely very useful. It's free to TD Ameritrade account holders and obviously very powerful for backtesting trade strategies you plan to eventually trade live. Now currently I'm backtesting the broken wing butterfly on the SPX. In the description below, I'm gonna include the link to the February results of my back testing of this strategy. So just in case you may be interested in possibly moving forward with a strategy like this. And I also will be creating new videos with further back test results of the broken wing butterfly and how I plan to better manage these trades when I do decide to go live. If you find this content to be useful, please give it a quick like. Please also comment if you have any on-demand tips to offer. And if you find this video useful, all interaction helps. Subscribe and hit that notification bell if you like to see more content like this. And as always, thanks for your time, as I know you could be any other place right now. Take care.